Hey everyone, I'm Curtis, the developer of OVR Toolkit. Today I'm going to quickly show you how to revert to the old bindings. It's really quick, I promise. Let's not like, let's not slack, let's just get started. So you can do this outside of VR, it's a lot easier. Uh, click on the drop down on the Steam VR status window, settings. You'll want to show advanced settings down here. Controllers, show old binding UI. Uh, you'll be greeted with this screen. Show more applications, OVR Toolkit. Edit your current bindings and keep mirror mode checked. Go down to grip, add a new binding. It'll want to be a, a button. Wait, yep, button. Unclick, not double, click. Um, set it to edit mode, then go on the gear. And you want to set the click activation threshold to 70, click the activation threshold to 65, and you can turn on or off haptics if you want, up to you. Uh, make sure that uh, generate click from is set to force. And tick. And yeah, now you can save it as a personal bindings, or if you just back out of it, it should save. There you go. All done. That's everything uh, that you need to do to revert it to how it was before, where you can double press the index grip buttons. Uh, just a little bit of context on why this change was made. For the past, it, it, I'm taking a stab in the dark here, but um, for the past 18 months or so, the tutorial has told you to double press both A buttons. This is because the grip binding is just, it's really, really inconsistent. We had a lot of users who would say, like, oh, why does OVR Toolkit randomly appear when I'm playing Beat Saber? But turns out they just, they held their controller too hard, and they just happened to grab it slightly harder, you know, with an interval. And, <laughs> you know, it would act as a double grip, right? And trigger the overlays to appear. I've had it with my own controllers, where I pick them up and put the controllers on, and manage to open the overlays in the same process. So, it's, um, from what I understand, grip just... It's stronger on some controllers, it's weaker on others. In general, if you have large hands, grip's pretty uncomfortable to do anyway. So, double A is better. Yeah, yeah, I know, you'll end up jumping in VR chat. You can remove it from one hand if you, uh, if you prefer, and just have it on, say, double A on the left hand, so you don't jump. But, you know, it's up to you. Um, play around with the bindings. The edit mode binding is what you're looking for. Doesn't need to be on both hands. Um, anyway, I hope that clarifies some things, so, <laughs> uh, thanks for watching.